Hey everyone, it's Chris for Tomo's Guitars and Basses channel. I'm here with Evan Ball, which is very nice. Thanks for having us. Yeah, thanks for coming by. You guys having a good, good show for good first day? Excellent first day, yeah. It's pretty yeah. busy, right? Yeah, yeah. It's always good people it's watching, good. if nothing else. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, so beautiful new finishes and even new guitars, right? Yeah, so uh, on the loop, we have a few new finishes. Um, let me run through the colors real quick. So we have um, Fuchsia Sparkle. Well, we're talking about sparkles. We have yeah. the Ocean Sparkle. All right, and if you feel like toning it down a little bit, we also have an olive pearl with black hardware. Um, so these new Lukes, the Steve Lukather model, they have uh, new electronics. So we have uh, Music Man pickups now. So, so custom Music Man pickups. And the HSS model with the single coils actually has our, our uh, cutlass single coils. So from our cutlass guitar, we put those in. Um, and this model, so here's our uh, maple top model uh, with Akume back. So these are alder, right? So this is a different variation with, with uh, maple and akume. Uh, roasted necks. And then, so this is a cherry burst. And then we have uh, Lucius Green. So yeah, not quite Lovely Lucius, but, but Lucius for, for, for Luke. How did you voice the humbuckers? Are these like for Luke? Yeah, for yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, for Steve Lukather, yeah. So he has, yeah. This, this, this is what he wants. Transparent sounding, medium uh, output sort of pickup. I think they're fairly hot. Like, they're pretty hot, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So that's just what Luke wanted, yeah. Oh, wow. Uh, sound great. It's super comfy guitar if you've ever played that before. Go over to the Saber. This is... Um, Stunning looking. Yeah, so maple top, and it's a it's a, it's an extra thick maple top. So it's, you can kind of see from the side, oh, it's yeah. it's fairly thick, the maple top, with the natural binding. Uh, flame tops, Akume backs, roasted necks, and um, custom Music Man humbuckers. But yeah, with with this thicker maple top, a, a lot of note clarity really cuts through really well. Uh, the the neck is slightly wider than our, oh, yeah. than most of our guitars. It's just a sixteenth sixteenth of an inch, but you can feel it. Just a little yeah, little yeah. more space between the strings. Okay. How uh, come how come you went for the other spacing? Just to just, mix it up. It's just preference. You know, I'm so used to the other. There, there's riffs that I play on on certain guitars where. Uh, my uh, finger fat, for lack of a better term, will, will kind of get in the way sometimes. Yeah, I mean, it's just yeah. that little bit where I can play the riff pretty pretty cleanly here. It's but it's, pre it's preference. You know, kind of like the Petrucci, if you felt yeah. that. You have a little bit more there. Yeah, on the width. So that's Blue Moonstone. We have uh, Bougie Burst right here. So so the color will dictate the, fret, the fretboard. So we have Rosewood on the Bougie Burst. This one's Ebony. Uh, Honeysuckle is the next one. Okay. You guys, the, to the roasted uh, maple board. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah, so that's that's my personal favorite right there. That's my favorite too. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Cobra. So that's with the black, black hardware and the maple neck. Yeah. So all flame, kume. Maple how, how would you describe the sound of the Sabre the sound? in comparison to other well-known models I, of I yours? I feel like the, the, the thicker maple top Really, it opens it up yeah, that that it, it, the brightness and and also like the note clarity. I think it, it really is is really clear. A lot of sustain too, oh, wow. but yeah. Petrucci Realm, new color on the JP15, Cerulean Paradise. So uh, got a figured top, maple neck. Not a bad neck there. Um, Majesty, we have some new color options. We have smoked pearl, pink sand. So these all have the the maple shield in uh, Akume, and then the uh, Honduran mahogany running all the way through on yeah, the neck. Yeah. Red Phoenix, the opaque one, so that's, and that's got basswood on the sides. And uh, Ember Glow, and uh, for 2020, uh, lim this is limited, 150 pieces for six string, 50 for um, seven string. So last year we did the Tiger Eye, so this year it's the purple, yeah, purple nebula. So this is where, instead of the shield, it's the full maple top. Um, and the neck, you can see the burst wow. finish. There's, it's right actually, the it's, it's three piece. Yeah. It's actually a hundred mahogany with a flame maple going down the center. So those three, those three strips are running all the way through ebony board. So yeah, you got a, got a lot of woods in here. Wow. So that, yeah, that's the purple nebula for uh, 2020. What's about this? Uh, this is uh, the volume pedal junior tuner. So something we're really excited about because it's just so practical. Uh, we have our volume pedal, but with a tuner with an enhanced definition screen on the on the front of it. So, so basically, uh, when you're in the heel down position, you have the tuner. So when you when your volume's off, tuner, and when you're up, it's it's really kind of handy. It's kind of an extra perk. You can see 
where you are. So you kind of make sure it's all the way up if yeah, you're on 10 yeah, or, yeah. you know, you want to back it off. It's, it's a little more scientific where you are. And especially uh, for people who use like, like seven or eight as a rhythm, and yeah, tennis, yeah. like your yeah. solo, it's like really kind of reassuring on you know where you are. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, so, and also you can have, if you uh, double click it, you can have tuner on all the time, which some people might always like to have a tuner on there. Um, so it's, a, it's actually a touch screen. Yeah, and this is something, like I was saying, I just think it, it's, there's so much utility for so many people because yeah. everyone needs a tuner. You don't necessarily, like I love playing with a volume pedal, but I don't have to have it. I'm kind of picky about what I add yeah. to my setup. I want a volume pedal, but but I need a yeah, tuner. Everyone needs a tuner, yeah. so so why not have the volume pedal? Patch cables. Yeah. So just just a small addition, but but I, but something that's very practical, right? Yeah. For every musician, uh, we have the the flat ribbon patch cables in three inch, six inch, twelve inch, and twenty four inches. And again, it's just you know no longer do you have to wrestle with your uncooperative patch cables and stuffing them in corners and everything. They do what you want them to do. Super low profile uh, connectors. And it's just, again, a, a practical tool for artists. So, yeah. I just told this off camera, I really love the fact that it's flat and narrow because all the switchers yeah, with all yeah. the jacks, which are really narrow together, you don't have the chance to plug in like all the other kind of cables. So it's very nice to have that option too. Slinky world. Yes, we're continually expanding our slinky line, filling in all those gaps so you can find a set that's perfectly ta tailored to your liking. So this year we have a mighty slinky, 8.5 to 40. So right in there between extra and super slinky. Uh, hyper slinky is a combination of extra and super, the plain strings being from extra slinky, wound strings from super slinky. Turbo slinky, very close to the, you know, good old regular slinky, but just just slightly lighter on the plain string. So 9.5 to 46. Um, so, you know, we had our hybrids. So this is right between hybrid and regular. So we're, we're getting into the nitty gritty. Uh, Mondo Slinky is similar to Skinny Top Heavy Bottom, but just a little light, I mean, sorry, a little heavier, 0.5 on each plane string, 10.5 to 52. Skinny Top Beefy Bottom, so we have our Skinny Tops mixed with our Beefy Slinkies. And uh, so Magnum Slinky, another heavy gauge, is very similar to, to Not Even Slinky. So if you look, I mean, the parameters are the same, 12 to 56. But remember, this guy's got that third string. It's the big old 24 plain yeah. string, yeah. which is a lot. Yeah. So uh, this is a 22 wound, so it gives you definitely a different feel. Um, but still, the 12 to 56. And uh, yeah, just more options for, for it's players. I nice have that option because that plain string is probably necessary for many players who don't want to have like a, a third string wound. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But for all those people who, who are used to like acoustic guitars, yeah, that makes a lot more sense to have yeah. a wound G string. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I mean, I, I, people are playing this aren't probably doing a lot of bends anyway. It's probably yeah. more, I mean, you could if you, you yeah. know, strong fingers, and, um, but, but you know, a lot of rhythm stuff. Yeah. Um, another seven string set, we have skinny top, heavy bottom, 10 to 62. Ernie Ball Booth, so cool. You guys have an awesome damn show. Thank you very much, Evan. And uh, you guys check out all the other videos on our hashtag ToneM20 and also subscribe to the channel and don't miss any of the upcoming videos. Cheers, guys.